Hello, my friends. Welcome back to Prophetic with Susie. And I am coming in with a quick word of encouragement from Jeremiah 31, 34, where it says that God will remember our sins no more. You know, this is his way of saying that, you know, God does not hold our sins against us. When he forgives us, he will remember no more. Just like in 1 Corinthians 13, where it says love keeps no record of wrongs. You know, we've all sinned and fallen short. You know, we all need God's mercy and his grace and his forgiveness. And he forgives us and he remembers no more. He doesn't bring things back up. He doesn't throw it in our face. He doesn't hold anything against us. So I feel like this is going to set somebody free, you know, in Jesus' name. We need to remember not to hold things against others. You know, we needed God to have mercy on us. So we need to have mercy on other people and not continue holding things against people that they did last week or last month or last year or 10 years ago, 20 years ago. Some people have had a hard time letting go of mistakes that others have made when the people have already let go themselves. They've been forgiven. They've been delivered. They've been set free. You know, and there is no condemnation in Christ. And so I just feel like this is going to help somebody today. Remember how much God loves you and has extended that grace and mercy on you. And we need to keep remembering to do that for other people. I know sometimes when people keep doing things, it's hard, you know, but we have got to stop holding things against each other, you know, holding things against people. When God is not doing that to any of us, he loves us and he says he remembers no more. It's over in Jesus name. God is so loving and good and powerful. He's a wonderful God and we need to extend that love to others. You know, we need to extend that grace and give people a chance because God is so good. So I pray this blesses the right ones. I just feel like this is going to set somebody free, that it's going to be a revelation that you've been seeking, that you've been longing to hear in Jesus' name. So I love you guys, and I'm praying for you, and I thank you for all your love and all your support, and I'll be back soon.